yes, the time is now, um, and I think things are coming together, right? Yeah. Oh, so woo. for my Peace Coalition friends, we've been here for 10 years now. <laughs> this is the war economy. This is very much the war economy. They sent our young people to kill and be killed. They invested in this financial speculations and scam, hurt our insurance, our pensions, uh, our, and they declared bankruptcy, right? That's what the state did. It declared bankruptcy and said, we don't have money anymore to put into your education, to educate your young people, to take care of you, to take care of the elderly. And that's the right the university wants. It wants to declare financial exigency, as they call it. They want to declare bankruptcy without the unions having a right to hold them accountable. And that's what we're fighting for. And if we let them get away with this, if we let them get away with basically declaring that they're bankrupt and fire us, we're going to create a very insecure, very frightened class of teachers. who are going to compete with each other. who are going to be frightened to stand up. We're not going to produce people like Dave Gilbert, who's here Woo! right now. Today, we will challenge the Toyota uh, Corporation. We're not going to be able to talk about media conglomeration and all of the media propaganda that, that we're fed. And we're going to create a generation who does not understand its place in the global economy. And that's the plan. It's to keep feeding this war economy with a generation that is ready to go kill and get killed. And that is why I've been here with the Peace Coalition and why I am now with my colleagues in the FA um, fighting to get this administration to accept the very minimum that unions matter because it is our kids who are being educated in these state schools. So this is a fight for our children and I'm here as a parent, as a community member and as a teacher. Thank you.